Imagine a soldier the size of an insect. The ultimate secret weapon. I am a tremendous fan of IMAX, a tremendous fan of the whole vision, how it's presented. Scott, I've been watching you for a while. You're different. I mean, I'm involved, and I can't wait to see this thing on IMAX. Skillful, agile, fast. When I go to a movie, I want to have an experience. I want to like, I want to have an emotional experience, whether it's laughing or crying. I want to be moved. And the IMAX format, it's just larger than life, and it's so sharp and it's so big, and you really feel like you're there. What do you want me to do? I want you to break into a place and steal some stuff. Makes sense. So much of the action is about playing with scale, and so the bigger the screen, the better. You tried to hide your suit from me. Now, it's gonna blow up in your face and destroy everyone you care about. The CGI special effects, and especially with the ants, is gonna be massive. With the IMAX, you're gonna go into like this teeny tiny world, and it's mind blowing. We go into this microverse and you put it on the IMAX theater, there's nothing that compares to that. That's the choice that I tell anybody, you're a fool uh, to see the movie any other way. When Ant-Man goes small and suddenly the entire world is huge, we'll just be amplified by the fact that there's this huge screen that is all encompassing and you're gonna feel what Ant-Man feels. <laughs> this would be a movie that I would insist on seeing in IMAX. One of the big things for me in the movie is when he shrinks down, I want to bring the audience down in that world. I don't want them to be immersed and it's got to feel real. And in IMAX, it's insane. Did you think you could stop the future? You're just a thief. No, I'm Ant-Man. I know, it wasn't my idea.